Hey there, buddy. What is going on? This is Becker, and welcome to the Source Wave SEO Beginner's Course. That is a mouthful of terms. But not only is it going to be a mouthful of something, that sounds gross, but it's also going to be really cool. So first off, if this is your first video you've ever seen on SourceWave, welcome. We're a place that makes cool SEO information, training, software, and other cool stuff for SEOs to digest and understand and have mouthfuls of. It's a very cool place to be, but let's get into that later. There's going to be a lot of cool stuff you're going to find on SourceWave, but you'll see that as the videos go on. What we're going to be doing in this course is first off teaching you the absolute cores of SEO. If you do not even know what SEO is, you've never made a website before, you're in the right place because we're going to take you from the point of not even knowing what SEO is to actually knowing what it is. First lesson stands for search engine optimization. Look how much progress you're already making. Uh, you're already at step two. Uh, and then we're going to take you from step two, which is not even knowing what SEO is and then now knowing what it is, all the way to being an intermediate SEO, aka being able to go out there and complete the process of SEO, know how it works and know how people make money with it and all that cool stuff. Now, what I'm going to try and do in this course that no other course has done, and I don't guarantee it's going to happen the first time, is actually get you money making results by the end of this course. Now, look, I'm not guaranteeing you're going to make money by the end of this course. Chances are you will not. The main point of this course is to get you from the point of not even knowing what SEO is or how to build a website to the point where you understand what SEO is and can perform it and in your second, third, or fourth try, get it right and start making money with it. If you apply everything in this course, you can actually go and start making money with it because the process I'm going to show you is very simple. So what I'm going to try and do in this course is take you from the point of not even knowing to having a website up and targeting the right keywords and niches that you can actually get results in as a beginner. And then by the end of it, have your first ranking, maybe on the first page for a few terms and actually see a light at the end of the tunnel where you can actually start making money with so that you can actually go and have success. Now, the reason why I want to do that is because when I first started doing SEO, the blueprints people gave me really didn't teach you actually how to make money with the process. It didn't really help me uh, pick a direction. It didn't give me an insight of where to go. And so I ended up spending a ton of time practicing and learning stuff that didn't matter. I just want to get you straight from not knowing to knowing to having a way to go out there and make money in a repeatable way you can keep doing it. So that's what you can expect from this course and the rest of the videos in it. Now, what we're going to do in the videos is in this first video, I'm going to be breaking down what SEO is and how people make money with it so you understand the concepts of how it works. And I'm going to kind of break down uh, the cores behind it so you can understand what actually makes websites go up and down in Google. And if you don't know what SEO is yet, uh, in a nutshell, is making websites show up higher in Google so that you get traffic from the search engines and then you can sell that traffic, all sorts of cool, jazzy stuff. Then in the remaining videos, what I'm going to do is teach you how to make a website, how to set up the on-page SEO of the website, aka make it so Google will actually rank it for stuff. And I'm going to show you how to build links to that website and actually make money with it in the last video. So with that all being said, we're going to hop into the first video and I'm going to show you what this whole SEO thing is all about. All right, what's going on? Welcome inside my computer. It's cool here and we have cookies, uh, which you cannot get, but I have cookies right now and you don't have any. How does that make you feel? Look where I am in life and look where you are without cookies. But you're going to be able to get cookies by taking this course. So uh, first off, before we get started, I want to offer you the chance to get tons more free training and software. Uh, what you can do to receive all this cool stuff is first off, you can subscribe on YouTube so you'll get updates and all the new training we'll be releasing on there, all for free, all really cool stuff. If you click right here, what you're going to have the opportunity to do is subscribe to our update list. And what this is going to do is update you whenever we release any cool stuff. And we're also going to give you a free software uh, that is able to auto rank you in local SEO niches, which is going to be really useful to you later on. Uh, so you're going to see us at the beginning of every video. I suggest that you subscribe to that as well so you can get the free software and training we're always putting out. And on top of that, I've created a free Facebook group for SourceWave, which you can join by clicking this button right here, or there should be a button below this video as well. And this is going to take you into a community where I'm hanging out. A bunch of other people are hanging out. We talk SEO and we just all kind of work together uh, to get a lot of progress. So be sure to check that out. Uh, and on top of that below this video is a share button. And when you click that share button, a whole rest of this course will be delivered to you. On top of that, as I'm going through this kind of stuff, guys, I'm going to mention Source University. This is where we teach really advanced SEO and really get into breaking how to make $100 to $200 a day with SEO. Each of our coaches is doing over 100K per month with their own SEO businesses. It's very cool. I don't suggest you join right now because you're watching the beginner's course, but I'm going to mention it a few times in these videos. And at any time, you can click the button below the 
this video. It won't take you away from this page and it'll just show you the hundreds and hundreds of results we've gotten for people. And maybe you'll want to join up with that. So without further ado, what the heck is SEO? That is what this first video is about. Now, what the heck is SEO? Well, that's what we're going to find out in this video. I'm going to tell you what SEO is. I'm going to show you how people make money with SEO. I'm going to show you examples of people making money with SEO. And I'm going to show you how SEO works in a nutshell and show you what you truly need to get started. If you've ever taken any courses like this, they are going to tell you you need a billion and one things to get started. And that's so they can go and link you so they can go and create what I like to call or what everyone calls affiliate commissions. I'm not really going to do this here. I'm going to show you to get started with the bare minimum, aka not having to spend a whole lot. Now, what the heck is SEO? What SEO is, is optimizing your sites to show up higher in the Google machine. Okay. And that's Google for you that don't uh, speak German or Dutch, whatever the heck accent that was. Uh, and it's specifically for certain searches. For example, if I had an acne cream, I want to show up higher in Google for best acne cream. I want to show up in the top three spots because that's where I'm going to get a lot of traffic from. And this is done by optimizing our websites and kind of manipulating the search engines a little bit. Before you ask, I get this question all the time from people that have never done this. No, it's not illegal. It's, it's 100% not illegal. Uh, there is no hacking involved and it is an ethical business that you can perform for companies on your websites and all sorts of stuff. There is some unethical stuff you can do in SEO. I'm not going to be showing you how to do that though because I don't do it and I don't suggest you do it. Now, as we go through this course, you might have already heard a little bit about SEO. You might have heard about black hat, gray hat, white hat SEO. What you need to know about all these things is that they're all the same. If you're doing SEO to your website, Google generally frowns upon it. Uh, what Google wants is for everybody to buy advertising. We don't do that. We go and make our website show up higher. And because of that, they generally kind of frown on it. And because of that, you're going to be wearing a hat of SEO. No, what you might have heard of is that these sites will get penalized or knocked down in Google. And while that does tend to happen, just know that if you're doing white hat or black hat SEO, you still run the risk of getting penalized and losing your position in Google. What we're going to be showing you how to do on SourceWave and stuff like that is stuff that's worked for the past couple of years. And as long as you stay up to date with SEO, it's generally easy to avoid getting penalized. So I wouldn't worry about any of that stuff right now. If you have heard about any of that stuff and it's any of your questions, you're worrying about it, Drop the questions and concerns right now. We'll address those later on in the course. Don't worry about that. Just taking what I'm teaching right now. Now, how do people make money with SEO? It's very simple. They make money in SEO by selling another person's product. This is what we like to call affiliate marketing. For example, if someone has a book on how to lose weight and then you rank your website highly in Google for the term how to lose weight and then you go and sell their book from your website via places that offer affiliate marketing opportunities. An example, this is ClickBank. But let's cut that extra detail out of there and basically what we'll do is we'll sell somebody else's book from our website and they'll give us a 50% commission on every sale we make. This is affiliate marketing. Basically where you sell another person's product for a commission or percentage of that sale. Almost every product you ever bought, any product you can think of online has an affiliate program where you can go and get commissions for anything you sell. So you can go make a website about snowboarding if you're really popular or, or passionate about snowboarding and then sell snowboards from the site and make you know a 10, 20% commission for every snowboard sale that you create. Now, with that being said, uh, a little bit simpler way to do this is just providing SEO for businesses or local clients. This is often referred to as local SEO. This is basically where we go talk to a dentist and say, hey, do you want to show up first for the term Dallas dentist? They're going to say yes. You're going to be like, okay, cool. I need a thousand bucks a month, which is bare minimum what you can charge for SEO. You can easily charge ten to twenty thousand dollars per month for SEO services once you get pretty good at it. Now, with that being said, we go and take these local businesses and we should make them show up highly in the local area or wherever it is. You don't have to work with businesses just in your local area. There's, I, You're probably not in Dallas right now, but we're sitting on the internet talking. So keep that in mind. Now, the other way we can go out there and make money with this is by renting websites and selling the traffic or leads from the website. For example, we rank a term for, I don't know, let's just say vending machines, North Carolina. Okay. Uh, and then what we do is we sell phone calls that come into that website. People call and saying, hey, I want to buy a vending machine. And we sell those to vending machine companies for 50, 100 bucks a call, which you can very reasonably do uh, in most niches. You can also put general advertising on your site. This is like putting Google AdSense. Uh, if you don't know what that is, it's just basically putting banners on your website, basically advertising you see on any other website online. 
For SEO, this is really ineffective because we're not usually going to be creating sites that are getting hundreds of thousands of visitors. And that's really what you need to make general advertising work for you. Uh, if you're getting, you know, a thousand visitors per month, two thousand visitors per month, you can easily make two to three to four to five ten thousand dollars from your website if it's targeted traffic and you're promoting the right affiliate offers or selling to the right clients. Uh, if you're just putting advertising on sites, it's going to be very hard to do that with that type of traffic. Now, let me show you some examples of this. Okay, so the first one I want to deal with, the first type of making money with SEO I want to deal with is affiliate marketing because this is what people most commonly try to get started. My personal opinion is local and client marketing is way easier to make a full-time income from very quickly, but I will get into affiliate marketing first. You can see right here if we type in best e-cigarette discount, just big general search like that. And if we go through, and I, I just click something right here, we're probably going to see an affiliate website, okay? Uh, so what we're seeing right here is this one, I believe, is, is kind of a bad example. But you can see right, let's go check out this one, uh, vapingcheap.com. You can see what the person's doing right here is he's reviewing e-cigarettes on the website. And essentially what he's doing is people will come here when they're looking for e-cigarettes. They went through Google. Uh, you can see they went through Google to find this website looking for e-cigarette discounts. And they come and find reviews of e-cigarettes. Now, when people go through right here and order this, this guy is going to get an affiliate commission. So they're going to go right here. They're going to click buy. Uh, for $52 and they're going to be sent to another website right here. You see how they went from one website, vapingcheap.com to fasttech.com and they're on this website and we went through an affiliate link. I think we can actually see the link go through real quick in the top menu right there. Now, if I go right here and buy this, I'm going to probably get, oh, I'm going to get the cigarette, but the person who sent me here is going to get about probably $25 to $20 per commission. We can probably also see right here, if we go and we see fasttech.com, that's the website we went right here. We go fast tech affiliate program. We can probably see right here the affiliate program this person's using. So you can see all this kind of stuff right here. Uh, and this is where we're going to go. So the person's earning a 3 to 5% commission and up. Uh, and the person who gets sent through is tracked for 45 days. So you can see this person's making money sending people and reviewing these e cigarettes. And it's just that dang simple. And that's how affiliate marketing works. Okay, so let's talk about local SEO marketing. This is where you go and take a client and you go and rank them in Google. Uh, we're going to be working with this a little bit more in this beginner course because it's a lot easier way for you to get started. I went in here and typed in Frisco Massage and this is a website from one of our coaches. He shares it off a lot of times and you can see right here that the website is showing up first. So basically this is his client. He goes through, uh, works with the client and basically makes their website show up first in Google. Because of that, they get more clients at the massage business. And that's all there is to it. You take on a website, you optimize the website, and you make it up to show up highly in Google. And you get paid monthly from the clients every single month. It's very, very common for people to take on a client and get paid 1000 to 2000 to 3000 bucks per month just to keep them in the top spot of Google, which is fairly simple when you get them there. Now, let me show you another type of search right here. If you go in and type in Plano Rhinoplasty, here's a website of mine. You can see it shows up first and second right here. And what I could do with this website, I use this purely as an example website. I share it a whole lot. So when I rent out this website, it gets some weird phone calls coming in from people that come to SourceWave. So I can't really rent it out because all sorts of crazy stuff happens. It's a really good example. Uh, what I could easily do from this is people go in and type in Plano Rhinoplasty. Now I could easily go right here and put a phone number on this page through a call tracking system, which simply makes it when people call that number, I see when people call that number, I can hear their phone calls, uh, I can track how many people call that number. And so I could go and have that call tracking number redirect to any of these other surgeons right here. And those surgeons would pay me easily 50 to 100 bucks per phone call because they make about you know two thousand, four thousand dollars per surgery. Uh, and so I could go out and rent this page out and sell the leads coming through the website. And that right there are my three personal suggestions on how to make money with SEO. This is how 95% of people make money with it. Of course, there are some really big websites out there that rank really highly in Google and get hundreds of thousands of visitors that people place advertising on. For example, we could go and just type in like how to lose weight. And what you're going to see is like, I don't know, uh, webmd.com. And you're going to see how they advertise. You can see they have, uh, basically advertisements on the side of it. And this is just general advertising and stuff like that. We're not going to try and create uh, the next one M WebMD. And you can even see people buying affiliate, uh, promoting affiliate offers right here. 
uh, when they're on this website. You can see through these ads, but we're not going to be doing that because it's generally not profitable enough, especially when we're starting out. So what I want to talk about now is how SEO works in a nutshell. You probably see all this stuff and you're like, whoa, how do we make this happen? Do we do like a magical dance or something? And yes, the answer is we do do a magical dance. I'm really good at it. That's why I'm a pretty popular SEO in the SEO community. Uh, and on a real note, I am pretty good at magical dances though. What happens is Google will sort pages like this. And this is not the everything there is to it. Okay, this is like the 30,000 foot view so you understand what's happening. Right? There's details that go into this. What we're gonna be learning in this course is how to do it without having to go through the deep details. I'm gonna show you the rank sites knowing very little about SEO. Now, what happens is Google goes and finds pages based on how relevant the pages are. Uh, for example, they look at the title of the pages. They look at the articles that are on the pages. They look at the words on the pages. So for example, if my website has plano rhinoplasty in the title and a few times in the text, it's going to be relevant to plano rhinoplasty. Then what Google does is it looks at signals going to the site and the sites it's found by these. I don't know what that means. That's a spelling error. Uh, but basically it orders the website by the signals going to the website. Now, the signals that are going to the website, which Google is going to find by digging through every page on the entire internet, that's what its spiders do, uh, is it looks at the few signals such as links to the website. Now, right now in the current Google algorithm, high quality links only have effect. Now, we can create a lot of high quality links. Back a few years ago, you could just spam the heck out of websites and they'd rank. This still works to some effect, but it's a very advanced tactic in SEO. And it's not something you're going to be able to do right off the bat. So what we want to focus on is building really high quality links, which we're going to show you how to get a lot of in this course without actually even doing anything complicated. It also looks at social signals to websites, for example, like likes, tweets, etc. You got to remember, Google's biggest competition is like Twitter and Facebook. If people start going to Facebook to get all their news and information, they're going to stop going to Google. That's their biggest fear, so they have to keep up to date. Easiest way to keep up to date is by looking at what's trending on those websites. So it looks a lot, likes, tweets, and what's being shared on social platforms. To another extent, it also looks at traffic and interaction with the website. If you have a lot of traffic going to a website, people staying on the site for a long time, Google's going to see that and you're going to get a lot higher rankings because of that. It's going to also look at a few other things. I'm not going to get into that right now because that's very advanced SEO. The main thing we want to focus on for the rest of this course is the links part of this. If we're able to go out there and consistently build high quality links that go to the website, we're going to be able to rank very easily in the niches we're going to be talking about in this course. So without further ado, that's all there is to it. Now to get started, all we need is a website that's going to be about $9 plus hosting, which if you go through a decent host will be about seven bucks a month. That's it. All right, we don't need anything else to get started in this course. Other courses are going to tell you you're going to need like keyword research tools and stuff like that. You don't need it right now. Everything we're going to be using in this course is 100% free. We might actually need uh, the Google Keyword Planner. Again, that is free. Uh, we're going to need WordPress, which is basically what we're going to build our websites off of. We are going to need WordPress, which is essentially what we build our websites off of. Again, this is a free platform. We don't need to know any code. We don't need to know anything. This is all just something a complete beginner to building websites can put together with a few clicks and you can build your website without doing anything. We're going to need SEO Yoast or all-in-one SEO plugin. Again, this is free. I'll show you where the plugin in. And you need the Google Keyword Planner, which is free because I don't know how to spell. So that's it. So what I want to do in the next video is we're going to get started picking out our niches and our keywords, and we're going to decide what to make our first SEO website about. It's going to be pretty neat, and um, it's going to be pretty neat. And it's so neat, I'm going to say that twice. So I'll see you in the next video.